Oh man, so y'all know the brat, the legendary rapper from the 90s. Um, she's also radio radio personality nowadays. So she has a wife, her name is Jessica, known as on um, the real bit with the Judy, I guess. I don't know. But as of now, the brat is pregnant, she's having a baby, and they just reveal that the sperm donut was a white man. Now, that right there, you can go ahead and move past that point. But most people were offended when they said the reason why they chose the white man was because the black guy wasn't attractive. Brat said the dude looked like like Jiminy Cricket. I'm sorry, but that wasn't going to be my choice. Now, to each their own. There's many reasons why you can put out certain stats and statistics to show that the pickings are slimmer when it comes to choosing black donors. But the joke that came on top of that shit as far as the comparison between a white guy and a black guy as far as attractiveness, that rubbed people the wrong way. Now, from that point, Judy has come out to speak on the situation. Here what she got to say right here. It's early in the morning, but you know what? Fuck it, let's 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 get into it. I see all of the headlines. Um, yeah, we we did an interview with a publication, and when we did the interview with the publication, they had access to the first episode. In the first episode, the first episode of Brad Loves Judy, we are in search of black donors. So, a question was asked around that because you saw in real time us trying to find a black donor and you saw the difficulties. There are difficulties. So there, there's a lot of facts in the world that people, I feel like, really don't know or are ignorant to. And that's that black men make up 5% or less of the sperm donation pool. And then even with that, once you put in your genetic testing, you'll be lucky to find, you'll be lucky to find one if any, I'm a carrier of four different things, four. And since we getting into it, I'm going to, I'm going to, in one of the slides, you're going to see everything and the severity of the things that I'm a carrier of. If we chose somebody that had the same thing, our child would most likely have it and they're severe. So 